taking control of our thoughts. 2 Corinthians chapter 10 verse 5 We demolish arguments and every pretension that sets itself up against the knowledge of God and we take captive every thought to make it obedient to Christ. This verse reminds us of the power of our thoughts and the importance of aligning them with God's truth. In our daily lives, we encounter many ideas and beliefs that challenge our faith in the knowledge of God. This can come from the media, our surroundings, or even our own doubts and fears. It's easy to get overwhelmed by these thoughts and let them affect our actions and decisions. However, Paul encourages us to take control of our thoughts and make them obedient to Christ. This means actively rejecting any ideas that go against God's truth and choosing to focus on what he says is right and true. It's like having a mental filter that only allows thoughts that align with God's word to stay in our minds. Think about it this way. Our minds are like a garden. If we let weeds grow unchecked, they will take over and choke out the good plants. But if we regularly pull out the weeds and nurture the good plants, our garden will thrive. Similarly, we need to regularly examine our thoughts, remove the negative or false ones, and nurture the thoughts that reflect God's truth. Now here are a few practical steps to help us take our thoughts captive. Number one, identify negative thoughts. Pay attention to the thoughts that make you feel anxious, doubtful, or unworthy. These are often the ones that need to be captured and changed. Number two, compare with God's word. Measure these thoughts against what the Bible says. If they don't align with God's promises and truths, they need to be discarded. Number three, replace with truth. Replace negative thoughts with positive truthful ones from the Bible. For example, if you're feeling inadequate, remember Philippians 4.13 which says, I can do all these through Him who gives me strength. Number 4. Pray for help. Ask God to help you recognize and change your thought patterns. He is always there to guide and support you in this process. And number five, practice gratitude. Regularly thanking God for His blessings helps shift your focus from negative thoughts to positive ones. Remember, this is not a one-time task, but a continuous process. Just as the gardener tends to the garden daily, we need to be vigilant about our thoughts every day. By doing so, we can experience greater peace, joy, and alignment with God's will for our lives. Let's make it a habit to regularly check our thoughts and ensure they align with God's truth. As we do, we'll find that our minds become more peaceful, our faith stronger, and our lives more reflective of Christ's love and truth. Let us pray. Lord, Help us to take captive every thought and make it obedient to Christ. Strengthen us to reject what is false and embrace your truth. Guide our minds and hearts to align with your will. In Jesus' name, Amen.